NetChoice, a trade association representing major tech players like Meta, TikTok, and Snapchat, filed a lawsuit against Ohio Attorney General Dave Yost, challenging House Bill 110 set to take effect on January 15, 2022. The law mandates parental consent for users under 16 on social media, aiming to protect children's mental health. NetChoice argues the law violates free speech, echoing past legal victories against similar laws in California and Arkansas. NetChoice believes parents should decide children's online activities with available educational resources, challenging Ohio's law that it claims unjustly restricts free speech. Governor John Husted, the law's proponent, accuses tech companies of addicting children but faces criticism for potential violations of First Amendment rights. Supporters claim the law empowers families to manage the impact of social media on their children's well-being. The law's backers argue that social media platforms exploit algorithms to manipulate users, particularly young ones. With concerns about mental health outcomes linked to technology use, Ohio aims to give parents more control through consent and transparency on data practices. NetChoice contends the law censors content requiring parental consent for users under 16 and privacy guidelines. The potential impact of Ohio's law on the digital landscape is significant, with NetChoice arguing it may infringe on free speech rights. Supporters believe it provides necessary oversight for parents and could shape how states approach tech regulation. The outcome of NetChoice v. Yoast will influence the governance of digital spaces, balancing free speech concerns with the protection of children online. If you like this video, consider subscribing to our YouTube channel so we can provide you with all the latest viral content.